Hello everyone. Welcome to Um in Going Medieval. Yeah, so we've got a raid coming and that's uh, that's basically uh, basically where things stand. Uh, so what we're we're gonna do uh, and it's spring we're going to uh, let the uh, the raid happen here, right? So we'll just uh, speed up time and get to the raid. Now what I'm going to do is uh, I, I want to do an experiment. I want to see if locking these doors, let's lock one of them, uh, will uh, actually uh, uh, keep the uh, the enemies from uh, uh, coming in while also still preventing a trebuchet attack. Uh, so that's the uh, the idea here. And uh, yeah, uh, I'm not sure how that's going to turn out, but we'll we'll uh, we'll see. Because uh, this attack here, we've got trebuchets coming, right? Uh, so I want to see what the uh, the attackers do with uh, locked uh, stuff. Now we could put something out in front, and that would uh, bait the trebuchets as well. Uh, but uh, okay, so we're not going to bow to the demands. Now, uh, eight enemies have appeared. Where? Where? Over here. Okay. Uh, over here, what we're going to do is we're going to draft everybody. Uh, you, 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 and you. Draft. You can come up here. And then you, you, and you can come inside. You can be drafted and come inside here. Okay. Okay. Okay, everybody's inside. Okay, let's uh, lock that. Now, what? Okay, prioritize. Okay, redraft. You go there. You have a pole arm. You go there. Okay, now, you go here, you go here, you, no, okay, you, you can go there, and you can go there, okay, there's our setup at our uh, thing there, now, the enemies have started their attack. What are they doing? Are all of them going to come? Okay, so, uh, looks like the trebuchets are operating. Are they? We got, what, four guys coming? Yep. Okay. Okay, they knocked a wall down. That's uh, unsurprising. Now we'll see what else they managed to do. Where are the other... There's two, three guys coming up this way. So the archers will start taking shots. Okay. A couple more things were, uh, were hit. Come on, you guys. 
Okay. We killed, uh, Ralph. Uh, roof was taken out here. Uh, okay. We have, uh, killed, uh, Tidger. Uh, okay. And we have, uh, killed that guy. Uh, Oswald. Um... Okay, and now we are going to kill, uh, come on, fire. We have killed Clement. Okay, now, where are these guys? We, how many were there? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, okay. Now we're going to have to sally out. Um, okay, so that means we're going to have to uh, yeah, unlock the door so we can get out. Okay. You uh, undraft prioritize. Okay, draft. Now, we'll take everybody. We're going to send them over toward the uh, the attackers. Uh, we'll send them over here. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah, so we'll, we'll do this so that we can uh, finish off the raid without... Um, Uh, without uh, keep taking a, a loss on it, right? So that means we need to just get our guys out here so that we can uh, actually uh, do something, right? Now, have we actually triggered them to come? Uh, we actually... Right. Uh, okay. 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 Okay, we kill this guy. I think uh, we end up. Um, yeah. Okay, we win. Uh, okay, we killed a smelting furnace and uh, walls and wicker floors. Uh, okay. Uh, okay, now we go like this, undraft, okay, good, um, Undraft. Uh, okay. So we uh, might as well uh, do that as well. Now, we need to rebuild some stuff. Okay. So uh, we're going to go in here. We're going to rebuild the uh, damaged walls. Yep. Uh, there. Right, those are okay. Those are oh, okay. That was a door, wasn't it? Uh, okay. Actually, no, I didn't have a roof on there, did I? Okay. Now, uh, we'll, uh, also, we'll come in here with uh, a thatched roof, uh, rebuild that, 
and uh, we're going to need this. No. Uh, we're going to need this again. We'll just do this. Yeah. Okay, yeah, we'll do that. Uh, that doesn't need rebuilding. This does. Yeah. Uh, and then uh, we need to... Uh, no, we don't need to do that. Uh, we need to... Uh, roof. Yeah. Uh, roof. Um, wicker roof. Uh, yeah. Okay, now we uh, hide that and, uh, ooh, damaged the ground a bit there. Uh, okay, now we had a smelting furnace. Uh, yeah, we'll put that in here. Yeah. Okay. Realistically, I think we should probably put a uh, a floor in here too. Yeah. Um, okay. Well, if we speed that up, okay. Right. Well, uh, we have uh, definitely survived that raid. Uh, that's uh, that much is clear. We have stuff that needs to be rebuilt, which will get rebuilt, and stuff that needs to be repaired, which will get repaired. Right. Uh, okay. So far, so good. What's this? Oh, it's stuff. What's this? A dead tree. Okay. Um, okay. Well, uh, hey, so far so good. We have uh, we have survived a raid, and we have learned that you don't lock your doors if you don't want a trebuchet to attack you. Okay. Ah, we're building a floor now. Yep. Uh, the idea is building the floor um, probably uh, uh, reduces the further damage to the uh, ground. Because you can't repair uh, ground, right? Okay, so what are we going to do here? We're going to dismantle things for metal. And we're going to do it uh, forever. And, uh, yeah, we'll just do that. Okay, let's, um, let's show the roofs again. You can see all the damage that still needs repair, right? Uh... Yeah, previously a single hit by the trebuchet would have taken these uh, roof bits out. So, yeah, uh, definitely better, definitely improved. And the trebuchets used to be able to shoot through the ground. So, you know, that was uh, always uh, useful as well. Okay, so far, so good. I think the repairs are just about done now. Okay, so we will rehide that. Yeah, I think the repairs are done. I think logically we should put up uh, some floors as well. Uh, in, uh, I don't know, in here. 
Uh, and in here, yep. Yeah, I think that is smart, and probably in here as well. Yeah, we'll definitely put some floors in. Um, because floors seem like a brilliant idea, right? Uh, yeah, floors are good. Definitely floors are good. Uh, right. Well, uh, we have uh, survived the raid. Uh, we didn't lose any people. And we are uh, building floors. And uh, when we get some more uh, clay bricks, we'll get more floors finished. Yep. Overall, uh, I think we did uh, we did okay there. Now, uh, this thing here is in the way. Get rid of it. Yeah, yeah, we get rid of it. Uh, okay, now, uh, what I also want to do uh, is uh, get uh, some stairs down into the moat from uh, inside here. Now, that, uh, to make sure that we that doesn't give us uh, a, uh, or some other access into the moat. Uh, now, to make sure that doesn't give us anything uh, that's going to help enemies, uh, we're going to need to do it, uh, I don't know, do it in back here, I guess. We'll do it over here where we can get some clay out as part of the, uh, the process. Yeah. Uh, um, no. Uh, do this. Yeah, we'll just get, get the, uh, the clay out of there. Uh, it'll take a moment and we can certainly use the clay. And, uh, yeah, and then we'll build uh, stairs going down there, and that will allow us to get into the moat uh, from the inside. Um, right. It's going to take a minute or two to uh, mine that out. And then we'll put, uh, you know, stairs there. Okay. Right. Now, if we go in uh, in here and we put a clay brick stair right there. We don't have enough clay bricks, apparently. Um, what if we put a uh, limestone block stair. We do have enough resources for that, so we'll use that. Okay, so somebody will come along and build that. And then, uh, right, and then they'll uh, go in there and mine, uh, somebody will go in there and mine under the, uh, steel doors at the entrance. Done. Now, uh, we are going around this way to pick up some material there, and we're mining under our doors. Right. Um, what is this? Rocky soil. Oh, so it's uh, it's something that's going to have a little bit of resources in it. Okay, so we're going to take a couple of uh, of hits there to uh, uh, to clear it. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Now, uh, we're going to uh, go in here and just check uh, underground here. Nothing was damaged underground. Okay. 
Uh, yeah, we can definitely uh, live with that. Good. Right. Now, what are we doing here? We're uh, strolling around here to do the final uh, mining and hauling. Uh, right. Okay. So there's one more, uh, one more hit, uh, one more dig at that, and it should uh, that should clear it. Uh, that's uh, going to require someone to go and actually do the mining, of course. Come on, people. You know you want to. Uh, apparently you don't. Oh, there, there's the guy going to do it. Then uh, we'll have a clear uh, path where we can go around the moat. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, anyway, uh, the, uh, my idea here is, uh, I don't think there's all that much more that's particularly, uh, interesting to do on this particular game in the state that, uh, the game itself is in. Uh, there's a lot of, uh, content still missing and under development. So that's definitely going to, uh, take some time to, uh, for the developers to sort out. So I'm thinking uh, what I want to do is, uh, it is, well, uh, I want to uh, take a pause here on Going Medieval and wait until they, uh, they, they've released some more updates, uh, until more of the content for the game is out. And once that happens, uh, then, uh, then, the idea is uh, come back and revisit it, right? Uh, when things have changed a bit, uh, was, uh, I, I just don't see the uh, uh, the gameplay being all that much different now than it has been uh, up to this point. Uh, the future gameplay is going to be basically more of the same, building my uh, village up, uh, you know, that sort of thing, right? Uh, and there's not going to be anything particularly uh, shocking about it, uh, you know, or or particularly uh, engaging, and no particular goal, right? Uh, other than building a thing that you you like, and you know, I don't see that that's going to uh, make all that much difference, you know, uh, in the gameplay. It's just going to be the same thing over and over and over again, right? And uh, yeah, as a result, I'm going to uh, I'm going to take a pause on going medieval. I'll keep the save game, and we'll be able to uh, revisit the save game in the future if it makes sense after some future updates. And yeah, uh, I'll I'll have something else uh, taking over the time slot uh, next week. I won't tell you what it is because I don't know what it'll be yet, but. Uh, yeah, I haven't figured out my schedule for that yet. Uh, I'm recording this just a little bit ahead of time, so uh, I don't know what things are going to actually look like. Uh, but anyway, uh, that's uh, that's gonna be uh, gonna be it for um for now and uh, going medieval as well. Uh, but uh, if you want to see what what I get up to else elsewise, you know you can uh, you know subscribe you know get may hit the bell maybe get some notifications maybe uh and of course uh liking and commenting and subscribe you know you know subscribing i already said subscribe uh maybe even hitting the dislike you know uh, that's fine too uh yeah all of that stuff and uh i guess uh, see you back for something else in the future